Did you know there are unconventional ways to grow tomatoes that could revolutionize your crop yield? Today, we're exploring innovative methods of tomato cultivation, ones that push past the boundaries of traditional farming. And the best part? You don't need to be a scientist or own acres of farmland to make use of these techniques. Whether you're running a small-scale farm or just want to spice up your home garden, these methods can be a game-changer. Buckle up as we delve into these intriguing ways of growing tomatoes. Ever thought of defying gravity and growing your tomatoes upside down? Well, it's not only possible, but also comes with a myriad of benefits. Upside down, tomato growing is an unconventional yet effective method. And today we're going to delve into how to set it up. Growing tomatoes upside down can seem quite bizarre at first, but it's a technique that's gained traction over the years. One of the significant advantages of this method is the reduced risk of soil-borne diseases. When tomatoes are grown conventionally, they are more susceptible to pests and diseases that live in the soil. In contrast, hanging tomatoes upside down eliminates this risk, as the plants never come into contact with the ground. Another benefit of this method is improved air circulation. When tomatoes are grown upside down, they have more space to breathe, reducing the risk of fungal diseases. Not to mention it also eliminates the need for staking, as the plant naturally grows towards sunlight, creating a beautiful and unique hanging display. Now, let's walk through the process. First, you'll need a sturdy hanging container with a hole at the bottom. Next, insert your tomato plant into the container, with the root ball inside and the leaves and stem protruding from the hole. Then, fill the container with potting mix, ensuring the roots are completely covered. After that, hang your container in a sunny location, making sure it's secure. Remember to water your upside-down tomato plant regularly from the top of the container. The water will trickle down, ensuring all roots get their share. Also, keep in mind that upside-down plants may need more frequent watering as they can dry out faster. Finally, monitor your plant for any signs of stress or disease. The upside-down position might be a bit of a shock at first, but the plant will soon adapt and start growing towards the sun. So don't be afraid to turn things upside down, especially when it comes to growing tomatoes. This innovative method not only makes for an intriguing gardening project, but also offers numerous benefits for the health and yield of your tomato plants. What if you could grow your tomatoes without soil? Welcome to the world of hydroponics. Hydroponics, in its simplest form, is a method of growing plants without soil. Instead, it uses a nutrient-rich water solution, allowing the plants to absorb essential minerals directly from the water. This method of cultivation completely bypasses the need for soil, making it an ideal method for indoor or urban farming. The hydroponic system has several advantages that make it a favorite among innovative growers. One of the key benefits is the efficient use of water. Unlike traditional farming, where much of the water is wasted due to runoff or evaporation, hydroponics recirculates the water, making it up to 95% more water efficient. Another advantage is the faster growth rate. By delivering nutrients directly to the plant's roots, hydroponics allows the plant to focus its energy on growth above the ground. This results in a quicker harvest cycle, meaning you can enjoy your tomatoes sooner. But it's not just about speed. Hydroponics also often produces higher yields. With the optimal conditions provided by the system, plants can thrive, leading to an abundance of delicious tomatoes. Setting up a basic hydroponics system for tomatoes might seem daunting, but it's simpler than you'd think. First, you'll need a hydroponic reservoir to hold your nutrient solution. This can be anything from a plastic tote to a specially designed hydroponic tank. Next, you'll require a growing medium to support your plants, such as clay pebbles or rock wool. Remember, this medium needs to be able to retain moisture while also allowing for good air circulation around the roots. Then, you'll need a water pump to circulate the nutrient solution and an air stone or diffuser to oxygenate it. Lastly, you'll need your tomato plants and the nutrient solution. Simply place your plants in the growing medium Fill the reservoir with the nutrient solution and let the system do the rest. Hydroponics might sound like a futuristic concept, but it could be the future of your tomato garden. 
Tomatoes don't have to grow alone, they can have companions too. Let's explore companion planting. In the world of horticulture, companion planting is a time-honored method of enhancing the health and yield of your crops. It's like setting up your plants on a blind date, where the end goal isn't love, but mutual support. It's about understanding the unique characteristics of each plant and how they can benefit each other when grown in close proximity. For our much-loved tomatoes, there's a whole list of plants that make excellent companions. Let's delve into a few of them. First up, we have basil. This aromatic herb isn't just a perfect match for tomatoes in the kitchen, but in the garden as well. Basil helps to deter pests that are notorious for damaging tomato plants like thrips and hornworms. Next, let's talk about marigolds. These vibrant flowers are more than just a pretty face. They have a secret weapon. Marigolds secrete a substance that deters nematodes, tiny soil-dwelling pests that can wreak havoc on tomato roots. Then we have carrots. Carrots and tomatoes are like the best of friends. As the carrots grow, their slender roots penetrate deep into the soil, helping to break it up. This allows the tomato roots to spread out more easily, resulting in a stronger, healthier plant. But that's not all. There are plenty of other plants like onions, nasturtiums, and barrage, which can also play a positive role in the life of a tomato plant. In essence, companion planting is about creating a harmonious community of plants that can support and protect each other. It's about leveraging the natural characteristics of different plants to create a healthier, more productive garden. So next time you're planting your tomatoes, consider giving them a companion. After all, as the old saying goes, the more the merrier. Remember, even your tomatoes could use some good company. Ever considered using black plastic mulch for your tomato plants? Let's explore this unconventional method, which has been gaining popularity amongst innovative gardeners. Black plastic mulch offers a trio of benefits that could very well turn your tomato growing game around. First off, we have weed control. As anyone who's spent hours hunched over their garden knows, weeds are a persistent adversary. But lay down a layer of black plastic mulch and it's like putting a no vacancy sign up for those pesky intruders. The mulch acts as a barrier, blocking sunlight and preventing weed growth. Less time spent weeding means more time admiring your thriving tomatoes. Next, we have soil temperature regulation. Tomatoes love warmth, and black plastic mulch is like a cozy blanket for your garden. It absorbs sunlight and converts it into heat, warming the soil beneath. This is particularly beneficial in early spring when the ground is still cold or in regions with cooler climates. Your tomatoes will appreciate this extra boost of warmth. Finally, black plastic mulch helps with moisture retention. Sounds counterintuitive, doesn't it? But it's true. The mulch reduces evaporation, keeping the soil moist for longer periods. This means less frequent watering, saving you time and conserving water. A win-win situation. Now you might be wondering, how do I apply this black plastic mulch? Simple. After preparing your garden bed, roll out the mulch and secure it with garden staples or rocks. Cut slits where you want to plant your tomatoes, ensuring a snug fit around the base of each plant. Remember, the goal is to cover the soil, not the plants. So, whether you're a seasoned gardener looking to try something new, or a novice seeking an easier way to grow tomatoes, black plastic mulch could be the answer. With its weed-blocking, soil-warming, and moisture-retaining capabilities, it provides a comfortable bed for your tomatoes to thrive in. And isn't that what we all want? Healthy, happy, and productive tomato plants. With black plastic mulch, you can give your tomatoes a comfortable bed to thrive in. So, are you ready to revolutionize your tomato growing methods? Let's take a moment to look back at the innovative techniques we've just discussed. We began by turning the world on its head, or rather, our tomatoes with the upside down growing method a brilliant way of maximizing space and minimizing pest problems it's definitely worth a try next we dived into the future of farming with hydroponics this soilless method using only water and nutrients might seem outlandish but it could be the solution to your tomato growing woes not only does it save water but it also allows for faster growth and higher yields then we introduced you to the concept of companion planting. By pairing your tomatoes with beneficial plant buddies, you can improve your crop health, deter pests, and even enhance the flavor of your tomatoes. 
And lastly, we explored the benefits of using black plastic mulch. This technique helps to warm up the soil, reduce weed growth, and retain moisture, creating an ideal environment for your tomatoes to thrive. Now, it's your turn. Try these methods out for yourself and see the difference they can make in your tomato crop. Whether you're a seasoned farmer or a green-thumbed novice, there's always room for innovation and experimentation. Remember, innovation is the key to success, even when you're growing tomatoes. Happy farming! Thank <laughs> you.